Hello, everybody, and welcome to another video. I'm just gonna set myself to be available for calls. Right. So, as you can see, we're playing as firefighters here on flashing lights. Wait, why did I open that door? I haven't got any calls yet. So, I'm gonna go upstairs, I think. And then we get used to a firefighter call when there's a call, which is always nice. There should be a call any second now. Um, yeah. No, I don't want to take that. No, for anybody who hasn't seen it, I'll quickly show you guys around the truck. So as you can see, we have the truck in here. You have the fire section, which has got all of the fire extinguishers, hoses, scoopers, fan, rescue, like the stuff to cut you out of cars, scene lights, chainsaws. Then we've got additional so traffic cones, road flares, that kind of thing. And then this is kind of the, you know, where you pump water in, in and out of the truck. Oh, yeah, we'll take that. Just gotten calls to a uh, vehicle fire, just down the road. So I'm gonna very slightly, yeah. For me. No, I can't. Not so ever. Not one bit. Right. Hopefully you guys can still hear me. Oh yeah. Smoke throwing. Uh, I'm gonna shut down this side of road actually. But not by a truck, by cones. It does take a bit to do each job because not only have you got to fight, you've got to secure the scene. Oh, I thought I'd run right off because I want to put the marker for him to stop on the back of the truck and also. Do we want road slur or traffic one? Probably traffic one just for this one. Yeah, that's them. Coming through while well, attempting. You gotta stop? Yep, good. Right, I'm gonna get the water hose on the truck. So we'll run on over and we'll start pumping. So this is actually quite a major fire on this car. Pretty well developed as well. But it shouldn't take too long to fight, hopefully. Yeah, because we're doing three spots of fire at once. So that's four out of seven, pretty much. You know, it's four out of seven. And then I can see that one is there. Not much of the smoke clearing very well, but. I mean, this call means that once we get back to the station, oh, I better put stuff on my radio, then we'll have to refill the truck because we're almost halfway out of water already. But there's a hydrant on the station ground that I can fill up from, so it shouldn't affect us too much. And also, if we do run out, which we won't because we've done six out of the seven, with just under half, and we're almost done now. It must that fire out. It must it will say fire department this fashion that it's done. We still got all the siding up to do, that's why I muted our radio. So we need to put this in there. And then we'll take these cones and get them out of the way. Thank you, sir. Very helpful. Missy stopped. Not sure about how this is volume wise for the game, so this is my first time really playing it well actually taking time in my YouTube videos. Because I've decided that I'm just gonna spend all my free time pretty much on this channel. Uh, let's go and I'm gonna turn my lights on just because I need to reverse into station.
Well, so yes, I'm gonna be parking from my bay. I'm also gonna run some water hoses to refill. So I shut off the engine. So, please do let me know what you think of this. By not only liking, but also like commenting what you think and that kind of thing. So we can only put the water supply hoses in that black bit. Nowhere else on the truck. And if I run over here, you can see numbers are going up. So we'll just wait a minute. And that is it. Pretty much, yeah, no, it's completely full. There we go. Then we'll say we are now available for calls. Don't know, do you guys want to see. Hold on, what's my. Yeah, it's still a lighting pattern like that. Do you guys want to see myself do a let's play at some point, or possibly not a let's play, just some random videos on the police version of this game? Container fire. Oh, it's my favourite call. And this I'm going to take for actual small pumper for one reason. That one reason is for the fact that it's a long drive where you need a lot of water. Oh, yeah, this should be fine. Because if I show you on the map, well, normally it's a long drive at least, I'm not sure. Hold on, where is it? It says it's up there. I can't see the green dot. Oh, no, I can't. Oh, God, that's far. So we're gonna have to absolutely fly down there. We'll probably be five, six minute driving at least. If only I was in a police car, this would be a lot faster like what we quite often drive in. And because I'm normally police, I have over 10,000 reputation points on police. And this I only have 1,834, so it's a slight difference. This truck really struggles to get up to speed, but once it's up to speed, it's up to speed. Please pull over. Thank you. Isn't it? Yeah, and then I just kind of take my here. So last time this was at a fuel station, it looks like the exact same location. So it's probably reignited. I'm seeing if he'd pull over from that distance, but no, he won't. Traffic in the AI isn't the best in this game. Like all the AI, humans, traffic, are just a bit weird. Like they don't always operate as intended. And this is the world's slowest truck. I forgot how hard it is for this thing to get up to speed. But I can see the smoke now, off in the distance. Yeah, it's just gone behind that tree. But it's a container fire apparently, so it'll be like a waste to get it in there. Yeah, there's the smoke here. I'm gonna pull on in. Uh, no, I'm not gonna pull it at all. I'm gonna signal people to go way around just because once it's very unlikely if some fuel's leaking, I could reach over there. So I'm gonna. Well, in real life, it wouldn't be possible, I don't think. But I'm just gonna, you know, play a bit different from most people would and give myself plenty of room as well, that's another thing I'm gonna do. So it probably looks a bit overly, but it is just for my protection. But I'm gonna park out in that area, so cars see the signal. 
because as you can see it's on the back, but it can be a little bit touchy sometimes. Yeah, other sides seeing it, so we definitely will on this side. Just reverse up a little bit so we have a bit more warning. I'm going to be almost setting the cone, but not quite. Right now I'm going to start the pump operation. But I think I'm going to do it where I'm going to take the supply hose and pump from the hydrant and then grab the proper hose. Going to go around? No, you're just going to sit there, you idiot. How dumb can you get with signals? Guns showing that you have to go around. Dumb though. Sorry about that. Wow. That's the most forceful sneeze I've done in ages. I could have hurt my shin then. Smash against the wooden part of my desk. <laughs> Honestly, I could do this with just, like a fire extinguisher or two, but you know, I want to go all out just because of its location. Because as you'll know, you don't want to mess around with fire by a fuel station. Because that could be pretty major for you. Like for you to have a couple of problems, you could say. Yes, make that disappear. Hello, please can I detach my hose? Okay, you want me to do it from that segment? So yeah, that's actually caused a fair big cue that person not being smart enough to go out run. What's the problem is it that I've got some cones or something rubbish like that. Then again to him cones probably makes him stop. No, he's just awkward. Actually that was kinda of silly of me putting the cones well in front so much that it's kind of half over that entrance. Honestly, I should probably also have closed down that whole side there to make this fully secure, but I aren't that smart. I don't know who we're talking about. Right, so I'm just gonna turn along here. And we've got the fun of driving along here. Uh, I think I'm gonna cut the trip to the station, so yeah. I'll see you in a second. Okay then, everybody. We have just arrived at the station, as you can see. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do one more call, and then it's gonna be the end of. So, I'm set myself to be available for calls, and I'm gonna go upstairs. As you can see, it's really just boxes all around the place. I don't think they've finished the fire station yet, and I don't know if they ever will because they're coming out of the new map. Oh, a vehicle incident. Yes! That's just done three calls in this video. Where's this one located? Playing hide and seek with green dots. Oh, okay. This is quite often a very bad call. There's gonna be another one where we're gonna have to rush to the scene. Multiple people will be trapped. Oops. That's not meant to happen. Better turn on my. I turn off that on because it actually makes vehicles stop better, believe it or not. Going on this side because that van was there. So 
the only reason I'm not running sirens is because I'm not sure how low it is right now. Probably isn't too low, but I'm kind of hopeful that it isn't. But I'll see in editing. Um, if it is too low, then I'm afraid I won't be going up. So if you guys have watched this video, but it isn't too too low, it might be a bit low, but it isn't too low. So it's still a fair bit up this road, it's just after the next exit. So you know, it's a bit of distance. I think I'm just going to end that side of the road over there. That's probably going to be my plan. going along the world's slowest fire engine ever. It's really annoying. I thought the other one was a lot faster than this. And again, it's starting to pick up speed. Maybe it's just, I think it's just struggles a bit for a while. There was also possibly the fact maybe I wasn't holding W hard enough, but I was mean, holding up pretty hard. Oops. Oh, the mine's I need to pay more attention. Yeah, we are just about to pull up on the scene. When we get on here, we should probably see the emergency lights in a second. Yeah, in fact, I think they're on the other side of the road where I am. Yeah, I can see them. I'm gonna pull up fairly fast, I think. Can I just turn on? Yeah, three vehicle incident. So apparently the police don't have the ability to close off the scene. So I guess I can do that since they are the police and they're too lazy it appears. I'm just going to use road flares this time because honestly, why not? So it's going to still be a fair distance that I have to flare out but and the only reason I'm going from this side is so I know when it's all ended. If any vehicles are smart enough then they can go up through that gap, but I don't think they are. And also I'd better quickly block off that area. Oh, they might be dead actually. I'm not sure. This is a possible fatality. I know it disappeared, so I'm just gonna take the cars. Well, spreaders, but you know, they have a fair weight, but so I wanna cut this person out first, probably. Then I go to the one who's getting police assistance last. I'll have to come back and check on them before ambulance arrives as well. I think that this is the van where there's. We know there's one in everybody. I have a feeling that he, he was probably a passenger then. But he's gotten shot out. Oh, actually, he was. Possibly, yeah, he, I think he was in that car. Yeah, he was in that car. How did he get shot? Oh, oh. Oh, I know that door's way up in that steering, so it's possibly been. I think medical wise, I'm gonna go up and around. I don't know, I don't know, but like up to the guy who's currently been, well, who's exited the vehicle uh, while it was still moving. Don't remember what it's called. Uh, breathing pulse sound, but they're unconscious. Okay, better than I thought, but still not in a good shape. There's pulse. Pulse. Here's a pulse. Oh, it won't let me do that leg. Hold on. That's really annoying. I'm gonna pulse. There better not be a fracture on any of these. It will so annoy me. Possible bone fracture. Great. So, I'm gonna 
What, request transport probably? Ambulance will take that patient from here. We've still got three others to attend. Oh yeah, there's ambulance. Uh, are they breathing? Breathing close on the conscious, but there is a possible neck injury. Oh, lovely. This is going to be like an FS video of just doing this. Well, yeah, fire calls. Ah. Oh. oh, yeah. I need to apply a neck collar and then I can request transport. It didn't actually tell me exactly what to do on the last patient, but it is with this. So that's that ambulance managed to pick him up. So we'll be taking him off to the hospital. All these guys will need to go. Even if it is just for a checkup. Just because of how major of an incident this is. Breathing close on con <coughs> conscious possible neck injury. Almost choked on my own spit there. If you need a neck collar and then they'll be ready for transport. That will be the person in the green van that I have to check over. <sighs> Honestly they aren't looking the greatest either. They're another one with what is more or less definitively a neck injury of some description. Yep, possible neck injury. No wonder he set his head off the steering wheel. Uh, well, it'll probably be full force because this is 75 mile an hour. So it'll be high, high force. This leg will possibly be. No, is it this one that's possibly fractured? Well, both of them I expected to have possible fractures. But somehow or another they didn't. That's something that is apparently really uncomfortable. A neck collar. I'm, I'm gonna. Say that I'm no longer available for calls because I've obviously still got to clear up the scene. Oh my. You idiot. Right, I'm gonna end the video here. Oh, I know I'm. I might struggle, so if this goes wrong, then goodbye, but I think I'm gonna manage to. Yep, I got into the menu. Sometimes it doesn't work. So, hope you all enjoyed this video. And, yeah, goodbye. Have a good time.